Hi friends, I am Ashish Chakravarti. Welcome to our channel Ganitantra. Here we will discuss some fun and magical part of mathematics which is not possible to teach in the classroom regularly. If you know the very basic operations like addition, subtraction, multiplication and division then you can easily enjoy this program. And I am sure if you enjoy this program then you will start loving mathematics. So, let's start. In our last episode, I told that we will be discussing about one mathematician. Unknown, much unknown, but he has done wonders with the numbers. Before telling about him, we will do one operation what he has done. Okay? Then we will come back to that mathematician. Let us take any four digit. 2, 1, 6, 8. Any four digit. Right? But one thing you keep in your mind, the digit should not be continuous. Like, you should not take 2, 2, 2, 2 or 5, 5, 5, 5. Not like that. So, with this four digit, what we will do? We will make the largest number first. How to make the largest number? You know, we will take 8, then 6, then 2, then 1. That means we will be arranging the digits in descending order. 8, 6, 2, 1 is the largest number. And what is the smallest number? The smallest number will be 1, 2, 6 and 8. So 1, 2, 6, 8 is the smallest number. If you subtract the largest number and smallest number, then the result comes 7353. Three. It is the first step of our operation. Next step. After this subtraction, we have got one more number, which is a four digit, 7, 3, 5 and 3. With this four digit, we will go to the second step. With these four digits, we will make the largest number, 7533. Three. And from there, we will subtract, subtract the smallest number, that is 3357. The result came here, 4176. Now, with the digit of this, we will go for the third step. With these numbers, I wrote here the largest number, 7641 minus 1467. Then the result came, 6174. Now, with the 6174, if you make the largest number, it will become 7641 minus 1467. You see, again the 6174 came. That means, this number became a fixed number, a constant number. Right? If you try the same operation with any four digit, and follow these steps after maximum seven steps you will come to the result 6174 any four digit number you can take you will see this number is coming at the end after five six or seven steps right this number is known as Capricar constant now this is the mathematician I was about to talk. D. R. Kaprekar. Dattatre Ramchandra Kaprekar. Dattatre Ramchandra Kaprekar was born in 1905 in a small village of Maharashtra. The name of the village is Dahan. You see, he was very much interested in mathematics. When he was a school student, he used to continuously do some operations with numbers. Though he was very much interested in mathematics, but he didn't get the chance of going for higher studies of mathematics, he couldn't even complete the post-graduation also. He was a school teacher in a small school in Nashik. But he used to practice and practice and practice with numbers and he found out many, many interesting patterns of number. He explored and found out Capricar constant which is 6174. He found out Demno numbers, he found out Harshad numbers, self numbers, many many things. 
but you see unfortunately he was not known to the entire world only in 1975 when mr martin gardner a great mathematician wrote about him in a scientific magazine that is scientific america then only the world came to know about d r kaprekar it is unfortunate that in his own country that is in our india he is not popularly known right but his harshad number specially and kaprekar constant is still a very important area of mathematics as we have told kaprekar's constant let us explain it once again with another number let us say if you take 1 2 3 4 from there we can make the largest number 4 3 2 1 from there if we subtract the smallest number 1 2 3 4 the result comes 3 0 8 7 the first step is done now by this number we will write the largest number 8 7 3 0 minus 0 3 7 8 you will get the result you will get the result 8 3 5 2 right and using the digits of 8 3 5 2 if you go to the third step you will get the largest number 8 5 3 2 2 3 5 8 and the final result comes again 6 1 7 4 that is kaprekar constant i have a question we have done this operation with four digits right now if you do the same operation that is kaprekar operation with three digit then also you will get another constant can you try yourself and find out what will be the constant in our next episode i'll be waiting for your answer that means with three digit number taking largest 953 minus smallest 359 getting the result and continue the process you will come to another constant number like this what is the constant number let us find out till then goodbye <laughs>